Mesial temporal sclerosis is another name for hippocampal scarring resulting from chronic damage to the mesial temporal lobe structures. The MRI hallmarks include loss of volume, increased signal, and loss of internal hippocampal architecture, as you see in this slice here. So increased signal, loss of volume, loss of internal architecture. This is a normal hippocampus on the other image. Unilateral hippocampal sclerosis is way more common than bilateral sclerosis. Mesial temporal sclerosis is one of the commonest causes of medically refractory temporal lobe epilepsy. Seizure semiology includes deja vu, fear, rising epigastric sensation, lip smacking, picking movements, fidgeting, staring spell, and postictal confusion that might last from a few seconds to a few minutes. Some of the risk factors include simple and complex febrile seizures, CNS infections, and status epilepticus. Interactively, the EEG shows anterior temporal sharp waves and ictally rhythmic theta activity evolving into temporal sharp waves is often seen. Drug resistance is very common with mesial temporal sclerosis. Patients often fail two or more anti-seizure medications. Epilepsy surgery is a good option for these patients and procedures such as anterior temporal lobectomy, selective amygdalohippocampectomy, and laser interstitial thermal therapy can be considered. Mesial temporal sclerosis targets the hippocampus, specifically involving the CA1 and CA3 sectors of the hippocampus. Astrocytic gliosis replaces the normal neurons, and granule cell dispersion can be seen in dentate gyrus. Thank you for your attention.